So our cannibalistic protagonist of this video will be the one and only Hannibal Lecter. I tried to base my character around the one from the TV show. I'm not too happy with how the outfit has turned out, but this is what we're working with. Okay, so I've gone for the surgeon occupation. Now, quite recently, I finished watching the Hannibal TV series where he had a background as a surgeon whereas he now goes into psychiatry. So I thought I'd give him the surgeon background just because I feel like that's probably the most accurate. I was debating between that or cook, but I thought surgeon would be more fitting. For his negative traits, a lot of these are not relevant. I just needed to balance out the good traits. So I've gone for anorexic, alcoholic, underweight, motion sickness, slow learner, depressive smoker and killjoy. I know they're not accurate at all, but you know, I tried my best. Whereas the positive skills we've gone for are light footed, insensitive to pain, cannibal, disciplined, evasive, and psychopath. If you're wondering what mods I like to use in my videos, do stick around to the end and I will show you the entire mod list there. And here he is, our little Hannibal the Cannibal. I think my aim for this challenge is to live a life of luxury. I want to get Hannibal living in a nice big house, have a nice car, and cook the finest meals with the corpse of his enemies. Now, this house that we're currently spawning into is not suitable whatsoever. In fact, the only reason I imagine Hannibal being here is because he's probably just disposed of one of his victims. Uh, we are catching a little bit of the cooking show in the background, which is useful because we are going to want to cook up a nice meal. I'm quickly realising I didn't give myself any good cooking stats, which is a bit of a failure on my behalf, as Hannibal Lecter is a fine, fine cook. Uh, let's see if there's anything useful here that we can take before we get out of here. I'm not really seeing too much of anything. Okay, we have spawned in with a knife, so I think I'll take that. To be honest, Hannibal has no clue where he is whatsoever. In fact, he doesn't really know anything about the world. He's not actually from town, you see. So not only do I have no clue where he's going, he has no clue whatsoever as well. Okay, someone's been camping out in my garden. Damn squatters, I imagine they're the people that we killed. Okay, this town is a little bit of a dump, I'll be honest. Oh, hello, you've got a lovely little bag we can take. Oh my god, there's so many zombies. Light work. Now, let's take this backpack from the zombie from earlier. Oh, in fact, we'll take their watch as well. That'll come in handy. Okay, our knife has already broken. All right, let's grab this corpse, see what we can do with it. I think I'm quickly going to run back to the house just to see if we can make a little meal out of this fella. Now, I could have sworn I saw some duct tape here earlier. Yes, I did. Can I repair my knife? Yes, I can. Now, is there a way that I can cut up this body? Okay, it didn't give me the option to eat him. That's a little bit annoying. All right, let's take care of you guys. Okay, we've already broken the knife again. Ooh, good cooking magazine, we'll take this. Now, let me try this. Let's grab this corpse. Can I put the corpse in the oven? No, I can't, okay. Oh, hello. Now, how do we eat these zombies, God damn it! Ooh. There's a little boxing gym that we found. Ooh, I've worked out here how to butcher the corpse. So I am gonna need a knife. Uh, okay, it's a little bit of a skew if way of doing this, but let me cook, I got this. Oh, hello, where'd you come from? Do you like to be my dinner? I am getting a little bit peckish now. Oh, hello. How are we both? Didn't mean to intrude. Oh, okay, there's a few of you here. Let's just lead you all out here, please. One at a time. Mother always told me not to play with my food, but I just can't help it. Right, let's grab one of these corpses. You're coming with me. Let's drop this corpse. I've just found a fresher one. Okay, I'll we'll take you now. Butchering a corpse. Here we go. Let's chop him up. Let's have him for dinner. God, he's a big boy. It's taken a while to cut up. Oh, some human bones. I think we can use these as a weapon, so I'll take that for now. Oh my God, look at all of the meat that came off you. I think we lob him in the uh, oven for now. Can I equip a bone primary? Oh, apparently not. It doesn't seem to work. I would have uh, quite liked to gone around bashing their brains in with a, uh, a bone. That would have been quite funny. Right, let's uh, let's get cooking. Right, let's get the settings all the way up because uh, I'm not the best to cook so far. How much human should we put in there? Let's uh, put the human 
heart in there first. We'll put his intestines in. The human fat. Oh, why not? Who doesn't like a little bit of fat from time to time? The human leather. Let's put all of that in there. Human liver. Uh, the human lung. Human meat. Ooh, a bit of human tendon as well. Sounds juicy. I probably shouldn't have put all of it in at once because now this is a lot that I need to keep up with. Uh, he turned into bacon, technically. So, oh, the lungs are burning. Quickly grab them. Grab all of them. Human meat. Oh, God, I've done it overdone. Uh, quickly grab all of the human bacon as well. God, I hope Hannibal doesn't like his food overdone. I feel like I've upset him a little bit. We're having this zombie uh, medium to well done. All right, let's sit on the ground. What do we treat ourselves to first? I think we'll eat the human heart first. Let's have all of that. Mmm, delicious. What else are we feeling? Let's have his liver. Lovely stuff. You know what? I think a bit of human meat as well. I like this mod a lot already. Who'd have thought a human would go so far with food? I can't believe it. I think I'm going to leave the rest of the human in the backpack. We can eat all of that later. Right, let's go exploring the rest of the house. Oh, hello there. Okay, why are we not causing any damage? It's because we have the bone in our hand. Okay, drop that. Now I should be able to attack you. There we go. Ooh, you have some heroin on you as well. How kind of you. We'll take that. That can be our dessert. Wow, I, uh, I don't know what kind of house has a urinal like that. It's a bit of an interesting choice. Ooh, we are feeling a little bit queasy. I, uh, I don't think we cooked the human meat too well. What the fuck is this? I actually have no idea what's going on in this room, so I'm just going to leave as I'm too confused. Let's just go out exploring a little bit more. Plenty of friends for us to say hello to. It's time that we make a feast. Our oh dear Hannibal is a man of class. This is really not a nice neighbourhood for him at all. We need to find him better. We have found a frying pan. I guess this will have to be our weapon for now. Ooh, you know what? I might make a stir fry from our human bacon. That sounds lovely. Yeah, let's add some condiments as well. Why not? Let's really enjoy this cooking. Lovely, we really seem to enjoy that. God, we're already getting great at cooking. We love that human stir fry. I think I'm going to abandon this little area and explore more of the city. Uh, I'm not too pleased with the surroundings here. Oh, hello. I'm sorry, I would eat you, but I'm already pretty full, I'm afraid. Uh, okay, I don't think it's worth us trying to get the attention of all of these zombies, I'll be honest. As much as I'd love the car in the car park. Oh, might be a bit late for that. Oh, we are getting a bit tired now. Now, I'll be honest, I thought I didn't have multi-hit enabled, although we are managing to shove two zombies at a time. Uh, if it is enabled, I will check my settings in a moment and get that disabled. Oh my god, this frying pan is useless. Okay, this just isn't working at all, so let's just lead them into the woods and try and lose them. Right, venture back into this little crack down, I'm afraid. We are too tired to go exploring. Ooh, we can meditate. Let's meditate for a little bit whilst I look at the settings. Ah, multi-hit is enabled. I will be turning this off now for the rest of the video. There we go. We're feeling at peace now. After we're done meditating, I think we'll treat ourselves to some of this human meat. And you know what? We'll also have a human lung as well. We've earned it. I think that should do us. So let's get ourselves off to bed. Now, I think our aim for today will sure be to find somewhere far more suitable for us to stay. Okay, it looks relatively quiet today, so I think we take care of the small clump of zombies and then check out this car. Alright, let's check out this motor, shall we? Okay, it seems to be locked. Okay, it's completely locked, so never mind. Uh, there is a little market down here. Maybe we'll go here and see if we can get like a bottle of water or something. I don't think uh, we need to worry too much about food. There are plenty of zombies for us to eat. Uh, anything here at the market for us. Oh, there is an energy drink. I will definitely take that, because if we get tired like yesterday, but with a bigger horde, we might run into some trouble. Okay, it seems to be locked. Let's check out the fine literature. I can't say that word. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> literature. Did I even say it right then? I don't know. Uh, another energy drink. Okay, take that. Okay, anything of use in here? Oh, plenty of snacks, but no, we're not a fan of this at all. Not for us. I think the ideal thing for us to own would be like a little burger truck or something. You know, something where we can cook the zombies on the go. What is this over here? Hello, how are you today? I must say, you look absolutely delicious. Ooh, a chef knife. We'll take this. Could never have enough knives. Can't tell. Is this meant to be like a school or something? Like I said, this is the very first time I've used this map, so it is completely new to me. Hello there. Our frying pan's now broken, so it's back to the fists. Who would have thought Hannibal Lecter would be a pro boxer? 
Oh, we haven't had any breakfast today. Let's have some more human meat before it all goes out of date. I don't want to waste it. Oh, plenty of books here. Okay. I feel like Hannibal would indulge in some reading. Oh, wow. There really are a lot of books for us here. I think I will just take everything that I can find and uh, I'll probably read them out once I actually get round to reading them. Oh, the school canteen. I'd imagine there would be some knives in the kitchen. We're going to need plenty of those. Oh, hello there. Should we let you in? Oh, I think so. It'd be rude not to. Oh, hello. You want to come join us as well? Now, I really need to find a weapon, and I feel like an American school is possibly the best place to find one. Any in the classroom? This is where I'd probably look first. Surely, uh, one of these children have an AK-47. Come on, like a little Magnum handgun, anything like that? Oh, apparently not. I thought this was America. How disappointing. A super soaker. Uh, is there literally any point in this? <laughs> uh, another Foods Around the World magazine we can take, but not a little else. And we are getting tired, so I think that, uh... Now is probably a good time for one of these energy drinks. Well, I'm incredibly disappointed with this score. Completely unrealistic. Not one gun in the entire building. See, even our character's getting irritated by this. Oh, hello. Where'd you come from? Oh, some Xanax. Definitely going to need that for later. Okay, we are a bit overly encumbered now, so what can we eat? Tell you what, let's have one of the human lungs. Lovely. Mmm, delicious. What's this over here? See, I'd be tempted to take a gun, but I feel like that might spoil the meat with the zombies. Oh, hello there. Oh, it's a church. God save us. I like to think that it was the zombies that put that sign up after uh, finding out I was here. Really in need of a weapon, not gonna lie. God, we are feeling stressed out after seeing all of that uh, wasted food. So let's have a little cigarette. Just to calm ourselves down. Now surely we are going to find a car soon. I'm really starting to regret picking this as my spawn location. Oh, meat tenderizer. We can use this as a weapon for now. Oh, hello all. How are we? Oh, fuck. Hello. Yeah, I'm not ready to be eaten just yet, thank you. Right, anything good on you guys? A salvage shiv. I mean, we'll take that as a backup weapon. Why not? What is this place here? Everything seems to be barricaded. It's uh, going to be a little bit hard to get into these places. Oh, hello there. How are you? Hmm, seems to be a little bit of like a little shopping area around here. Let's just quickly check out this truck. Okay, fantastic. This is locked. Oh, hello there. How are you? Oh, fuck, hello. Oh, no, one of the zombies has set off an alarm. Not good. Okay, yeah, we... Oh, fuck. Okay, we are not in a good enough condition to do this now. Oh, my God, where are all the zombies coming from? Yeah. Oh, that is a police station as well. That would have been lovely to raid, but we are going to have to pass up on it for now. Okay, I didn't realise how many there actually were. Maybe it's time that we have another energy drink. Okay, we are... A bit more awake now. Oh, okay, yeah, we've just broken our meat tenderizer. Let's quickly get out of here. Okay, quickly, quickly, quickly. Try and lose them. Okay, there is one right behind us, and that one has a very cool hat. Oh, fuck, the others found us. Ooh, there is a vehicle key here. What vehicle is that actually to, though? Oh, my God, yes, it is to the pickup truck. Oh, fuck, there's no fuel. Uh, there is a car up there, but if there's no... Oh, there is a petrol station right there. Okay, right. We're going to have to rest at this motel tonight, I think. And then we will push on maybe tomorrow to try and get some fuel in the truck. Right. I think we just sit and hide behind this bed for tonight. And we are going to power through all of these books. So we're going to start with Cooking Volume 1. We'll read the Emotional Intelligence book. We'll read Fishing Volume 1. Foods Around the World. Foraging Volume 1. Uh, Lane's Automotive. Metalwork Volume 1. Uh, and the Power of air pressure. We'll power through all of those tonight. Now, we are still pretty hungry, so let's eat this other human lung for dinner. I'm glad I cooked all of this in one go now. All right, we are getting a bit peckish again, so we'll have another snack before bed. Uh, we'll have another chunk of human meat. Lovely. Right, Dr. Lecter, straight off to bed. All right, we awake at 7.30 in the morning. Our mission today, get some fuel in the truck and get the fuck out of here. Oh, there is another car over there I'd quite like to check out as well. I would stay and check out this part of the map more, but I just think uh, Hannibal Lecter would want to stay somewhere a little bit more civilised. Alright, 
Let's check out this car. This feels more like Hannibal's style. Oh, it does appear to be locked though. Oh, no, okay, we can get in. Nothing useful in that car apart from the two maps. So let's see if we can get a jerry can. What delightful things do they have here? There are plenty of things for us to read, lovely. Again, I'm not gonna bother looting any of the food. I think for this run, it only seems appropriate for us to eat zombies. Okay, we haven't found anything to store some gas. So let's see if there's anything here. Surely we can get a gas can here. No, but we haven't found a pipe wrench. I guess we'll use that. Ooh, an axe. Yes, that is a lovely weapon to use. Oh, there is another axe here. Let's add that to our back. Ooh, an empty gas can. There we go. God, what a little spot this has turned out to be. We'll take that propane torch as well. Lovely stuff. Right, let's push on out. We're going to fill up the empty gas can, take the car around here, fill it up properly. And then once we've done that, maybe drive around the map a little bit, you know, explore the area before we then look to live somewhere a little bit more suitable for our liking. It's not quite the elegant car that we're looking for but it will do for now oh this old girl's got a fair few miles on the clock and it's also not in the best condition oh shit it's going to be even worse condition now right let's go fill up the truck right refuel from the gas pump lovely the truck is now full let's get back inside right let's have a little drive around the area see if anything else catches our eye oh i think this is the edge of town oh okay I've already crashed again. I need to pay a little bit more attention, I think. Right, this place has been an absolute dump, so I say we just get out of here. Oh my god! Oh, oh. Um, we just took some major damage, not just to the car, but also to us. Uh, I didn't realise the turning circle was so awful. Oh my god. God, we really need to be careful. This car can't afford another big knock like that. Oh, break, 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 break. That's better. I think whilst we're uh, driving along as well, we'll uh, treat ourselves to a little cigarette and eat some of the uh, fresh bacon as well. Why not? So what's the best option from here? I guess maybe we just go straight on. I don't want to go near Maldra just because I absolutely hate it there. I forgot my character does get queasy from uh, driving, so probably shouldn't be doing too much. <laughs> Okay, I think we uh, we need to actually stop and have a little rest. I feel like if I was going to make my character motion sick with driving, I probably should have made them either a student driver or a Sunday driver. Kind of regretting that a little bit. Right, tell you what, let's head up north a little bit. Okay, I don't know what this is. Uh, I guess we're going to have to turn back around. I don't know, I think, yeah, maybe we're going to have to go back to the main road. I think going north was a bad idea. Ooh, be careful, we can't afford to hit any of these zombies as I immediately then hit one, for God's sake. All right, be careful, be careful. This is way too many for us to deal with. All right, just keep going. God, there's so many. Okay, surely this will now take us up to Rosewood. Yes, okay, the drive through is to our right, so we're definitely near Rosewood now. I mean, this here would be a very useful spot for us to stay. How many zombies are near us? No, it's not worth damaging the vehicle for this spot oh there is a motorhome here okay i think it's got to be done we're going to take the risk we're going to try and kill the local zombies with our truck and i want to get my hands on that motorhome it may not be too elegant but we can make it elegant god this must really be making him feel sick <laughs> oh no 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 please don't cut out here no 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 oh god all right the car switched itself back on don't know how it did that Oh my god, we can't even kill the ones that are downed. I tell you what, we better be able to get in that RV considering I have just completely finished off my truck for it. Oh, fuck off. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Where did you come from? Right, I guess the fire station we'll have to do tonight. Let's hope there aren't too many zombies. Oh, we are a bit hungry. So let's eat some uh, some stale human meat now. Okay, we do need to get some fresh humans to eat. Okay, there just definitely are going to be zombies in here. Oh, fuck. Hello. Yep, yeah, there's a few. Okay, uh, how about this van here? You got some space? That'd be lovely. Nope, but I tell you what, I am going to try and sleep in it if I can. Oh, hello. You must have come from the uh, fire station. How are you? We do need to be careful because we are exerted and we are still tired. I think we quickly pop in the fire station uh, see if there's anything useful in here for us. God, there are a few zombies in here. Right, let's keep pushing on. In an ideal world, the RV key will be in here somewhere. The 
We are finding plenty of magazines to read though, so it's not all bad. Come with plenty more axes, but we don't really need them at the moment. Ooh, plenty of medication. Let's take all of this. Bush machete. Oh my god, yes. Right, straight upstairs we go. Let's just go to bed for a little bit. Right, straight to sleep, mister. God, we're still highly exerted and tired. I think I might have to change one of the sleeping mods. I have one where pillows from previous sleeping. However, we just can't find any pillows whatsoever. Uh, I think I'm going to quickly span through some reading first, though. Damn, there's a lot of books and magazines that we just went through. Right, we'll eat all of the fresh cut bacon that we've got left. We'll eat some of the lard as well. Okay, so I've played around the sleeping settings. I've even uh, changed up the Moodle settings on here to the one that I prefer. So we are back on edge. So let's eat a little bit of this stale bacon. A bit more of the lard as well. Fatten ourselves up. Yeah, we need to get ourselves a uh, another zombie soon. We're getting hungry. I think we'll save that for the morning though. Okay, I didn't realise we actually get new stats to learn from some of the mods that I've got. So we are all the way up to meditation level four. I'm actually quite impressed with that. Dancing we need to work on and music as well. Uh, we're quite a bit off on those at the moment. So what, now's probably a good time to meditate a little bit. We are uh, not feeling too too well. <laughs> Let's just go to sleep. I can't lie, I think I've broken the game with some of these sleeping mods because we are still tired despite waking up after what, like five hours sleep? Uh, what can we do for now? So I think we're going to eat some lard to start the day. Okay, I think we uh, we do need to wash a little bit. There we go. Very nice. Maybe we'll wash our clothes next as well. Hoping this stops us feeling queasy. There we go. We're looking good as new now. Let's just hope we can actually get some sleep. Okay, we're waking up nauseous, agitated, tired and exerted. Right, I guess maybe just find some energy drinks. That might have to be our solution. You know what? We're hungry again, so let's just go find one of those zombies from earlier, cut them up and uh, have them for dinner. There we go. There's a nice little corpse that we left from earlier. And we'll take you upstairs. So far, we've only eaten one zombie. I feel like this is a pretty poor cannibal run. Okay, let's craft some food. There we go. Very janky way of uh, cutting up corpses. Okay, perfect. Now that they're cut up, let's put away some of their uh, bits in the uh, fridge, why don't we? Just so it doesn't go stale again. What are we actually feeling today? I think I'll just cook the standard human meat, you know? Yeah, we'll take the human meat. Let's cook you up. Five big chunks of human meat going in the oven. We'll uh, turn on the oven whilst we're at it. Get the settings going. Turn that on all the way. Uh, I think we'll have a little smoke of our cigarette whilst we wait for this as well. How's our meat looking? Pretty good. Let's grab all the meat before we overdo it. Let's try and have it uh, at least medium rare this time. Let's eat a nice big chunk of human. There you go. I think I'll decorate our bones as well. Let's uh, just scatter them out across the table. Just so when any zombies walk in here, they know not to mess with us. There we go. Decorating the place with our lovely bones. Uh, we are not looking in the best shape. Who would have thought that eating uh, zombies would make you feel bad? Get yourself to sleep, mister. I think I'm going to have to rest before I go out and do anything. But uh, we can't really stay here. I'm just going to have to deal with being constantly tired at this rate. We're gonna have to find some energy drinks or something to make us feel better. Oh, hello. Terrible idea, considering it's 20 past 11, but we're gonna venture out and try and find a home for us to stay in. Oh, fuck, hello. Where'd you come from? Oh, fuck. Okay, this is a lot of zombies. No, 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 no. Okay, this is not good. Okay, right, just get in the van. Right, oh, I just wanna get the hell out of here. No, 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 no. Get the, get the, no, <laughs> no, oh no. Right, out, okay. That's completely totaled, so no point messing around with that. I guess we're just going on a little walk for now, whilst very tired, in extreme panic, and moderately exerted. You know what, can we sneak away into the police station, get our hands on a shotgun or something? That'd be lovely. Oh, fuck, hello. There's a few more of you over there. Let's see if one of these cars has a key in them. Uh, no, but it does have some maps, which we'll take. Uh, should we survive? Okay, that was uh, very risky. I'll be honest. Oh god, we are on the verge of passing out. Um, just hold on, mate. Keep holding on. Some energy drinks will come in handy right now. Right, there is a car park back there. Oh, it's got, we've got to check it out. Right. Any of these pick off fancy? Uh, let's pick up the pace a little bit. Get some distance between us and the zombies after all. Is there a key in here? No, it's locked. So is that one? Oh fuck. Can't afford to run too much, but I'm gonna do it a little bit. Oh my god, don't all be locked. Oh fuck. Okay. Oh, and we are just bumping into more zombies. Oh, just stressy. Let's have some more human remains. It feels kind of fitting that Hannibal Lecter would die being eaten by zombies. I can't lie. Oh, there is another RV. There is another RV. Come on, pick up the pace. I'm going to take the risk. Come on, please, 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 please. I really want an RV. Okay, okay, we've got in. No, okay, no, no key. All right, get in here. Okay. 
Okay, that's another one. Fuck's sake. Oh, God. We are getting so unlucky. Right, there's another car park back there. Let's go and try there next. Right, are you going to be open? Yes, yes, you are. No fucking key, though. Okay. What about this one? What about this one? Oh, you've got to be joking. What about this one? Oh, my God, yes. Oh, my God, yes, yes, yes. You can't be serious. Oh, go, 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 go. Get up, get up, get up. Okay, we are injured now. Okay, we've just scratched our hand. Uh, we can we can deal with that. Put a bandage on it. That's so typical. As soon as we find one that looks good, there's no fucking fuel in it. All right, check out the Hummer. Okay, we have got into it. Uh, what it, Whatever this is, I'm taking it. Oh, run, run, run. Run. Okay, move, move, move. Okay, okay. We're bleeding again. What have we done this time? Uh, okay, I've somehow been bitten on the neck. I genuinely don't know how that happened as I was climbing out of the car, but... I somehow did. Sick. Okay, that's just fantastic. Right, you know what? Open up these boxes. Right, we've opened them up. Insert the magazine. Let's fuck them up. Bring it. Okay, we're terrible at shooting. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. And it's already jammed. The gun's in horrible condition. Fantastic. Eat some more of the human meat. Yeah, if you're going to eat me, I'm going to eat you guys as well. Take that. I don't think we've hit a single zombie. Okay, and we're out of bullets. Fantastic. Well, let's get the axe. Hannibal Lecter has not been as efficient as I thought he would be. Okay, they've somehow bitten us again. We've been bitten twice, somehow on the lower torso this time. Am I missing something? I did not see them bite us. Oh, have a little smoke, my friend. Yeah, it looks like this will be the end. Well, this has been one absolutely horrendous run. <laughs> And that is the end. Okay. So Hannibal the Cannibal survived for four days and only killed 113 zombies. With that, he only actually ate two of them as well. So that is pretty horrendous. I was expecting this run to go a lot better. A lot of the mods I've installed seem to affect the way that he slept. So he was constantly tired. And even then, like, we got bitten twice somehow, which made no sense. So... I'm going to go away, play around with my mods and settings a little bit and make sure that everything is set up and properly working for the next video. But if you have enjoyed this video still, I would very much appreciate a like, you know, subscribe if you want to see more Zomboid content. Likewise, whatever challenges and things that you want to see me do, let me know down in the comments. I do read them. I have installed a few mods based off some people's suggestions, uh, such as uh, the Only Cure, the Amputation mod, which I'm looking to use in the future. I was hoping I could use it this time around maybe, but I'm pretty sure I was bitten on my torso neck so it's not like i could amputate anything um so yeah again like i said let me know down in the comments anything you want me to try out again i'm gonna fix my mods and make sure things are working for next time so thank you very much for watching i hope you all have a great day thank you